Hi everyone, this is Annie Slater coming to you from Brisbane, Australia and hi out there in the world. It's um, Wednesday night here in Brisbane and it's the middle of winter. It's July and it's cold and I'm here in my Ugg boots and all my warm woolies and I just wanted to throw together a quick screen capture on Twitter and some of the tips and tricks that I've learnt along the way. So the first one is if you don't have a background on your web page, on your Twitter account, I'd recommend that you get one. If you're not sure who to use, just send me a, a direct message or an out reply and I'll uh, give you some names, uh, certainly who did mine, who I was pretty happy with, but there's plenty of options out there. So now what I want to discuss with you tonight is a couple of tricks on how to build up your following. Now I'm just going to go into this particular guy here. He's a business owner, real estate investor, DJ, piano entertainer, poker and, and blackjack kid, uh, Charles. So now if you find somebody in who works in your niche, that's probably a good place to start. Now if you click on their followers, so what I suggest you do is go through and follow the people that are following um, this particular person. Um, now one of the things I choose not to do is follow anyone who's got funny little icons for their profile picture. I like to follow people uh, with a face, where there's a face. So I just go through and um, follow people in this list and keep going through for about five to six pages and that will give you about 50 to 60 people a day and that's a quick way of building up the people you're following. Uh, more often than not people will follow you back. Uh, the way to do that and set that up for your account is to use this application called Tweet Later. So it's www.tweetlater.com now you can either register if you don't have an account. I'm just going to log in. So use your, um, or you'll get a, an ID, an ID once you register. Log in. Now you want to come down to this particular uh, link. Manage my scheduled tweets and Twitter account. I've already got one set up. You'll need to set one up, so I'll just go in and edit. Just walk you through some of these options. So you need to enter your Twitter username in this first box, and then your password. All pretty uh, straightforward. Now I choose to use the auto welcome, so tick that box. I've got a welcome here that also invites people to find me on Facebook, and I've got a, my link to my Facebook account and that appears in their DM and I find that I do get quite a bit of traffic to my Facebook uh, from Twitter. Now I've also got the auto follow checked which I was talking about earlier so anybody that follows me I automatically follow them back and I don't have to do any of that manually and I also choose to unfollow people who unfollow me and that's an automatic unfollow and then just save those changes and that's all set up for you. So I recommend you use that. It is a great way to save time. Um, now the other thing that I recommend that you use is one of the applications that shows you all your tweets all set out um, on the one page. Now the one that I, there's a couple out there, the one that I use is TweetDeck and it's a pretty much an industry standard. Uh, now you can put your tweets in up the top here. You can see all your friends, any replies that are sent to you, direct messages. And also over in the right here, this particular column has two, um, two um, things that it does. First of all I've got a group set up so I can see specific tweets of people I want to follow more closely rather than uh, this all, all friends field on the left which updates very quickly. This one on the right shows me specific tweets 
can set up a group just by clicking on this groups icon, giving it a name and then checking uh, each of the names that you want under that particular group. You can set up more than one group, it's up to you. Okay, so um, what else can I tell you about this page? This column also, if you want to have a look at anybody in particular, you can just click on their name and their details will then populate in this right hand side of the screen. So you can flick through and just have a look at what they've been up to. Alright, well that's it for this video for today. I just wanted to keep it short. So good luck with your Twitter. If you've got any, any questions at all, please feel free to uh, direct message or at reply me. Probably at reply will get you a quicker response. And I wish you every success until the next video. Ciao.